It's feeling quite cold throughout northeast Michigan with temperatures mainly in the middle 30s. It's 35 degrees in Alpena, 36 degrees in Oscoda, already down to 33 degrees in Atlanta, also 33 degrees in West Branch. We have a light breeze coming out of the west at 8 miles per hour in Alpena, 6 miles per hour in Atlanta, a little stronger to the south of Alpena. Winds are blowing at 17 miles per hour in West Branch and 13 miles per hour in Oscoda. Currently cloudy skies with a temperature of 35 degrees. Those winds out of the west and relative humidity about 69% our atmospheric pressure is rising briefly. We'll see some clearing taking place this evening. That clearing is already underway over parts of Illinois and Wisconsin, and we may in fact start Saturday with some sunshine, but I'll be watching some moisture coming up from Texas combining with this storm system that's now moving through Idaho, Montana back towards Nevada as well. This storm system out towards the west will move across the upper plains and into our area affecting the second half of the weekend. So for tonight, briefly decreasing cloud cover and some morning sunshine on Saturday, but then the clouds are going to increase. And by Saturday night, we're going to have rain moving into our area, staying as rain heading into Sunday and throughout most of the day on Sunday. We'll have some soggy weather, but then late Sunday evening into Sunday night, temperatures will drop and become cold enough that we could see a change over to some scattered flurries throughout northeast Michigan. The highest snow amounts will be closer to I-75 because of lake effect snow off Lake Michigan, but we could see a light dusting around Alpena Saturday or Sunday night rather and then going into Monday some drier weather will move in but also cold temperatures early next week for tonight lows near 25 degrees in Alpena 23 in Oscoda 22 in Mayo skies becoming partly cloudy Jupiter and Saturn most visible around supper time looking toward the south Mars becomes most visible around 10 p.m. and the best viewing for Venus occurs at 7 in the morning for tomorrow we'll have high temperatures getting up to 44 degrees in Alpena 43 in Tawa City 45 degrees in Onaway some nighttime rain moving in and winds are going to increase to about 20 miles per hour by late in the day on Saturday. So the winds remain on the lighter side this evening and into early Saturday, but by Saturday evening, those winds will increase coming out of the south or out of the south southeast at 15 to 20 miles per hour. Then on Sunday, the winds are going to get even stronger. Once the wind direction shifts out of the west, that will bring dropping temperatures and we'll have wind speeds of 20 to 30 miles per hour, maybe some higher gusts going into Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. So for tomorrow, we'll have high temperatures near 44 degrees, nighttime rain temperatures in the upper 30s early Sunday, highs near 50 degrees around midday, strong winds and dropping temperatures giving us a potential change to some nighttime flurries. And then on Monday, certainly colder with highs near 40 degrees, temperatures will drop off to the middle 20s early Tuesday, mostly cloudy skies, cold all day long with highs near 34 degrees. So we're definitely going to need to put on those winter layers early next week. Highs on Wednesday, 37 degrees, mostly cloudy skies, becoming a little bit milder for the end of next week. Highs in the middle 40s for Thursday and Friday. Still a lot of cloud cover across our area.